Well, since the format changed after our first year, uh, it's basically a one-shot game. Like you got to be there, you got to be ready to go right from the start. Uh, you can't hold anything back, and you can't kind of ease your way into the tournament. Everybody's got to be going right from the get-go. So uh, there's a couple guys that go down, but uh, one of the things that we've had all year is depth, and we have lots of guys that can step into roles. And everybody seems pretty confident. Guys are stepping up into big positions now, and everybody's just trying to get going this week and find some chemistry with some new lines and uh, giving those guys that have injuries a little bit extra time to recover this week here. So when you know you're graduating and you have no more eligibility left, uh, kind of comes into realization that it's your last chance and you're going to give it everything you got to try and win that national championship. So We were pretty fortunate to have our depth this year. Uh, you know, around February 1st, uh, we started losing guys left and right. And, and uh, you know, up at one point we had seven guys that we were missing, you know, from our starting lineup. And, you know, that's, that's the beauty of it. If you carry 25 or 26 guys, you can get away with it like we did. I mean, there was lots of nice people that were happy with us. But our young guys pulled through, uh, pulled us through and got us uh, the chance to go to Nationals with uh, a win against Gallagher. Number eight beat number one the last two years. Uh, there's been upsets all over the place. Uh, I think that every team that's going to be participating in this final eight format is going to be a good team. So, um, I don't like the format. The one and done is an awful long way to go for uh, for you know any group of people trying to get themselves organized or situated. But it is what it is. So I would like to play Alberta in the final.